and I'm back again with another video. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. And if you're new, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. So y'all, welcome to another vlog. Today is January 14th, one day before our Founders Day for AKA. I'm super excited. My line sisters came in from Alabama, DC, North Carolina girl all over to celebrate in Houston. So I am super excited. Um, earlier you saw us at my townhouse before everybody got here. We went to the breakfast club. We also went to the Galleria, but I don't think I got that on camera. And then now we are at the Airbnb. So I am in the garage because I wanted to give y'all an Airbnb tour. We're staying in the Heights. And if I can get the, um, information i will definitely link it below if we have a good stay here but so far so good it's a three-story townhouse it's super nice and i wanted to go ahead and give y'all a tour so this vlog should be really exciting because we're going to go to some houston restaurants we're going to prospect park to celebrate with all the other aka's and everybody else who want to come tomorrow for founders day and then we're also doing a service project having dinner and ain't no telling what else we're gonna get into so i'm super excited so if you want to to, you know, turn up with your girl for Founders Day. Go ahead and stay tuned. But I'm gonna go ahead and start the little townhouse tour. Okay, so this is the first level. That's the front door. That's the garage. Hey, Shasha. Hello. This is a really nice bedroom. It's hot. Okay. You turn it off. Okay. Oh, you good? <laughs> this is super nice. So this is the first level. And then you go upstairs. To the kitchen, dining, and living area. So this is the kitchen. Super fire. Hold up. Look at this oven. Look at this fire oven. Somebody really took their time with designing this because this just looks so cute. So this is the kitchen area, big island. Look at my sis Ray, looking so pretty. Dining room, ooh, okay, little chandelier. Uh, I mean, I would say turn the fireplace on, but it's hot in the mug. Oh, it's a little bar area. <laughs> and then this is the third level, so we got a living room area here. I didn't think another room way. here. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. And then this is the room me, Ray, and I think Kayla are staying in. But this room is super huge. This townhouse is definitely goes. Like they were saying my townhouse was good, y'all. Was nice. But this right here, if I don't bring somebody here to a place like this. That goes for real. And y'all, look at the bathroom. I'm gonna turn off this vent because anyway, I got time for that. But look at the bathroom. Got the tub. I would love to have a tub like that in my future home. And look at the shower, y'all. Look how big the shower is. Oh my gosh, it has a waterfall on the top and on the side. Like, they was not playing. And then you got this big old closet. Oh, oh, okay. This is a little creepy, but that's nice. I'm gonna leave now, cause that's a little much, but. <laughs> but yeah, so that's pretty much it for the townhouse tour. I think we're gonna figure out what we're gonna eat and do all that. We're gonna have stroke practice later. 
just buying and stuff like that. So, you know, I'll hit y'all back up when we got something going on, but I'm super excited for the weekend. We've been having so much fun. They enjoy Breakfast Club and we just been having a really good time. So I will talk to y'all in a bit. Today is Saturday, it is officially Founders Day and I am literally headed out the door to go pick up some of the other girls so that we can head to Kiss for brunch. But I wanted to go ahead and show y'all the fit. Hopefully I can get it all in here. But I got this green um, two-piece set from this Instagram boutique called Pink Plastic Babes. And then I have on these like dupe um, I think they're called Aminas, but they have like the bow and they're super cute. All this jewelry is from Fashion Nova. I mean, not Fashion Nova, Forever 21. And then I also got this pink purse from Aldo. So I think it's cute. Hopefully I can get a good pick, but I feel super cute, super classy, and I'm so excited for Kiss. So let me go ahead and get off here so I can pick up the other girls and I will see y'all in a bit.
Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Feeling young, but they treat me like the OG. And they want the tea on me, I swear they just nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we gon' see. I won't put no money on his head, my niggas owe me. I gotta be single for a while, you can't control me. Uno those traits in a race, they can't hold me. And I show my face in a case, so you know it's me. Imitation isn't flattery, it's just annoying me. And I'm too about it. In the dirt that they do on my name, turn the soil and I grew up by it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gon' do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling. I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. But honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me. If I ever heard one, and I'm still here outside, front line, south side. I've been losing friends and finding peace. Honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me. Look, don't invite me over if you throw another pretty party. Looking back, it's hard to tell you where I started. I don't know. I know, I know that you're drunk. Yeah. Tell me what you want after this club. No, you're not sure. No, you're not sure. No. Don't go ride in my house. You caught a taxi. I'm picky with my women. I'm deciding. What is up y'all today is Sunday so sorry I could not check in yesterday y'all we were literally going from one thing to the next super busy so that's why most of it was b-roll but just to recap um we got up and went to kiss for brunch it was so good the vibe was so good we had a really good time there and then we came back to the house afterwards and we got changed into our matching j15 shirts and then some of us went to walmart to pick up the stuff for our service project one of my friends from baylor named asia was collecting backpacks suitcases and also toiletries for girls in foster care through houston cps so when i saw that i went ahead and reached out to her so that that we could go ahead and get the donations to her and it was really good we came back we all put the care packages together it was super cute um i will try to post a picture over here um i didn't get too much footage of that because we were kind of rushing so that she could come and get it and then we briefly went to prospect and then we came home changed really quickly and we ended up going to taste of texas for dinner so founders day was so amazing like i literally could not imagine being with a better group of line sisters like i was just so happy i was really emotional like it was crazy because i was more emotional on founders day than i was when i was initiated into the sorority i feel like this was perfect timing for me you know i feel like sometimes we think people are going to be in our lives you know for longer and that's not necessarily true like everybody has seasons in our lives oh i just was kind of you know find trying to find a way to you know connect with you know other people who were like-minded as me and stuff like that so thankfully i found houston let's link in april and then um in october i was able to become an aka and that just connected me with even more women who just have the same vision are so supportive are always there and we're all like at different stages in our life so if i need advice for one thing or if i can give it advice to somebody else because I've been through it like I don't know how to put it into words but all in all I'm just extremely grateful and everything happens for a reason and I feel like you know even though it um, was something that I had always wanted and tried to do it in undergrad but wasn't able to do it um, I feel like it's like the perfect timing like God's divine timing is always right he knew what I needed exactly when I needed it and this is like and there was literally no better time for me to have like so many women around me to like support and who I can support than now so I'm gonna get off my little soapbox um I am like super hot and sweaty because we are actually downstairs making breakfast for everyone today we also are going to a um, black owned winery so that's at three and then afterwards we're supposed to be going to Chapman and Kirby for like a little day party and we're gonna get food there and stuff like that so hopefully everything goes good it's been super cold here and windy I don't know what Houston is doing 
but um, hopefully I can find an outfit to wear to the winery, but I'm just super excited. So I just wanted to catch y'all up from yesterday. I'll go ahead and get some footage of us, you know, eating and stuff like that. The food looks really good. We're gonna have shrimp and grits, pancakes, biscuits, sausage, bacon. I made the breakfast potatoes. We got fruit, we're gonna have eggs. So we're gonna throw down because we don't need it because we're doing like a whole wine tasting um at the winery later and we gonna need some food on our stomach so i just want to check in i hope y'all are enjoying the vlog and i'm about to go ahead and go downstairs and eat with my sisters baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel a chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced so come on now It is like weeks later and I'm editing this vlog right now watching Pastor Keon and I just wanted to hop on here right quick um, to close out the vlog because I never did. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. I'm really sorry it was really choppy but honestly I'm just proud of myself for even getting any footage because I am good for trying to vlog and then it gets to be too much and then I just quit the vlog and it don't be put out but you know i'm trying to be better this year and like i said i hope y'all enjoyed it i'm sorry like it wasn't as smooth as my other vlogs if this is your first time watching or anything like that tuning in i promise you the other vlogs be way more smooth like i had like some phone footage in here i'm trying to crop all this to make it look nice so i'm sorry i hope y'all enjoyed it um i was happy i captured it i had such a great time with my line sisters i can't believe it came and went but we had a really good time we bonded we strolled we did service and i am just so excited for boulet in july like i miss everybody so much already um and it was definitely like a girl's trip for the books like definitely started out 2022 wonderful i know i need to change my smoke detector batteries i promise i'm gonna do that right after i hop off this camera yeah i just wanted to hop on here and close out the vlog i wanted to do it yesterday when i was real cute 
but it just didn't happen stay tuned for the brunch and trap and plant vlog that will be coming out um maybe a couple weeks after this i don't really know y'all thank you so much for watching if you made it to the end you're a real one and i'll see you in my next one